Hello everybody, welcome back to Let's Play Hatches Go 4. Last time we competed in a stage trial and unlocked a new course. Yep, course 5. Level 5 of difficulty. This is a difficult course. This is... In Hatches Go 3, this was the last course you unlocked and it was the hardest one. However, there's still one more if you haven't noticed. Yeah, we'll be getting that soon enough. But who shall we play as today? I know this place you need to be hitting high. So, I'm gonna keep an eye out on that. Don't wanna play in the gym. Sam? No. You. You know, I don't think we've ever actually played as come up. So let's go right ahead. Nah. I made you pick me. Yeah, let's go with you. This course is rather difficult in that it is like it doesn't put a whole lot of stuff in your way, but you can't. But if you hit high, you're gonna be able to hit over a lot of the obstacles that puts in front of you. Other than that, this course is just naturally windy and decently long on a lot of holes. So, I mean, you can still do this with like low hidden characters like Uyghurs, Mo, Mel, those characters, but. So I recommend to have someone that can have a little bit of power to them. But, you know, I'll be honest, I don't suggest using like full on power characters. They are just overkill. Should be decent. Nah, didn't play enough window. Alright. So we are getting close to the end of this game. I mean, we're not going to finish it by the end of the year, because Christmas week, most likely, I'm not going to make any videos, and good potential that next week I also won't be making any videos. But this is what I mean, because if you choose, like, a high-hitting character, you can hit way over here and be safe. But whereas the wind, because it's not helping in this case, the wind is very difficult to look around, because it is, it is naturally going to be high like that. So this course is difficult because the wind is always against you. And has very narrow fairways on a lot of these holes. Yeah, no, let's not go for that. Let's just go ahead and pretty much aim where the game sent us. I'm gonna put up a, back, a bit of backspin so I can get a little higher so the wind can take it to the more open part of the fairway. There we go. Because it is a part five, we can take another shot here. And be fine. And I know I'm hitting it a little hard, but wind uphill. Yeah. Oh, please. Oh, there we go. I know it was a very long chip in, but I'll take it. There we go. It's so weird that I see the alternate ego animations. I don't think I don't even think every character has one. I think it's just one of those deals where it's like, okay, this character will have one, this character will have one. Right, I'm gonna hope that this pushes me far enough to the left that we go on that hill, but not far enough that I go in the sand trap. And I think it didn't even push me that far. Yeah, it's close enough because on this hill it's a lot easier to get over this. And because we're leaning that way, let's go ahead and do a right side curve so we can get around. Yeah, that's also why you want to be a high hitter because some holes like that require you to shoot over trees no matter what. And that's difficult to do. And we are pretty much in the last category of tournaments here. We are getting very close to the end of these. There's only two more stage trials left. And you can probably guess what courses they're on. If you guess course one, you'd be in <laughs> It'd be kind of funny if they did, but I, I guess you guys really wanted me to. I could make up some like, challenge for myself on that course, because course one is ridiculously easy. Okay. That hole can go on sometimes because it's surrounded by a lot of sand traps. I 
All right, maybe we can check this line on in there. Nope, not even close. <laughs> well, take a par. Yeah, there we go. Alrighty. And also, a lot of holes will have stuff like that in your way. And the wind, once again, not helping. I'm just hoping this most likely will not reach that sand trap because of how high up the fairway goes. It's not going to get as much distance as usual. So there we go. A nice shot in the middle. But that wind is not being helpful. Not at all. Let's just do that and see what happens. Over the tree. Around the bend. Past the hole. Coming towards the loft. Still on the green. <laughs> Alright, we're more further than usual, but I think it's because the bounce I got. Okay, didn't do that right, but no. Take another par, and keep going. Please don't. Okay, I was worried. Here we go. We're doing pretty well. This course is very difficult. This is one of the hardest ones. Hardest holes on this course. Because it's very far down, and the wind is normally going with the and I'm downhill, so it's very difficult to actually land on said green. That being said, I'm hoping that this will work. Yeah, oftentimes you want to put a backspin on just to save it from rolling too far. I don't think I'm gonna make it, but I'm gonna get close. That's close enough. And I don't know if you guys can tell, but for some reason to myself, I can I sound really congested. Even though I'm not congested at all, it's just how I sound in, to myself. Now this hole, if you can if you can land on this downhill part that gets darker there in the middle, if you can land on that, you can roll almost all the way down to the green. Like you can get like a 400 yard drive on this hole. But we're not hitting hard enough to do that, but I'm still going to always try to land on that fairway in front of it. Yeah, you can reach the green in two sh in one shot, almost ridiculously easy on this course. I mean, on this hole, not this course. And that was lucky. We got lucky there. But hey, luck is all you need sometimes. Mm, okay. Because this is going way down the hill, and the wind's pushing it. And I didn't know as the wind was going that way. Actually, no, it should still be decent. Yeah, it's still decent. This would be key for us. And a lot of these are downhill. At least all the putts I'm getting. <laughs> but hey, another buddy. And there you go. I don't think we're gonna get the back tee unlocked in one try. I think we're getting to the point in the tournaments where we're most likely not even gonna not even going to get those because we have so much we have so many courses to go through we're not going to be getting advanced mode on all of them anymore and i decided to use the power shot just to see if i can counteract the wind and it did ah uh, if the hole wasn't there i would go for this but the wind is in the right spot to screw that shot so i'm gonna aim a little off the green to be honest Okay, that's okay. It's not the worst thing that could have happened, so I'm glad I didn't aim at the hole. Okay? But we'll still end up at the sand trap somehow. <laughs> Alright, let's see if we can get that out of there. Oh, come on, game. Couldn't give me that. Oh, yeah, it really won't. As long as I paid attention. Okay, they went for it to the left than I thought, but it was still pretty much a straight on. Alrighty, about halfway through, we're doing pretty good. Yeah, I see a lot of courses will do that. But in this case, for some reason, this isn't out of bounds over here, so you can just aim right here and be safe a lot of times. But I'm not going. Actually, yeah, I will. 
I will solely because the wind is pushing it as well. And it's easier to get over those trees there. And because this isn't out of bounds, as long as your you know, character isn't bad in the rough, well, this is a pretty good alternative to going for the fairway. I'm hitting it that hard because I have very bad luck with this. See, I got 90% for my power. So there we go. Yeah, if you're lucky enough, you can land on the fairway if you're using a harder hitting character than I am. It's not that difficult to do that shot. If you don't want to deal with the potential of going out of bounds. Always the bigger potential of it because you're going around it but you're aiming for the rough which isn't bad if your character's good in the rough it's no different almost there we go do that toss spin to kind of add some of that and get a nice shot <clears throat> of course Alright, uh, let's just go full power on this thing. I know it's not enough though each, but I don't need to use a driver because that won't get enough height to get over any of this. It'd be nice if it did, but it's not gonna have the power there. Ah. Uh, close, but no cigar. That should be good. Enough. <laughs> there we go. Keep on trucking. This one's difficult because once again that the fairway is curved specifically towards the sand trap there. So I'm going to actually aim in front of it in a little shy. So I can end up behind it. Just like that. And this is also a pain because the green is right next to water. So I'm gonna be hitting that full power because the wind. And because the green is also a slight bit uphill. And even then, we barely made it on there. Don't pick at it. Hit the ball. Oh boy, this is it's an awkward one. Alright, I'm gonna say probably about a straight on shot, honestly. I didn't get enough power. But. Yeah. I did get enough power, but I didn't expect it to get that close. That'll work. There we go. Yeah, we're not gonna get the uh, back the unlocked. And this is one of those other holes, just like hole eight, just like course eight. It's a pain to stay on the hole because all the obstacles and the fact that it's downhill as usual. Yeah, I'll take that. I know it's not close at all, but I'll take it. I hit a little harder than usual. And holy sugar, should I have turned that more? Oh well, we'll take a part. I think we've got enough points to win anyway, so far as are fine from here on out. I'm pretty, pretty sure. But at the same time, I'm not sure. I'm still going to aim for buddies. Obviously. Now this hole, if you're really lucky with the wind and your luck, you can actually land on the green in one shot. Because imagine if I was hitting about 290 now, be alright at the fringe there so and the wind if you land on the cart path you could land on the green but we're not hitting that hard so we're gonna drop this short so we don't end up in the sand nice and this tree likes to screw you every time but thank for I hit it far enough that tree on the left that small one that one right there in the middle of our screen that one really likes to screw you on this hole Why couldn't that have been an eagle? Anyway, let's keep going. And let's see, today's versus mode is going to be Louise, I believe he said. We're getting into the difficult character. <laughs> Getting to the point where it's probably going to take two or three tries to beat them. 
Will I make two to three videos? I'll probably make two videos on a character. If I if I don't beat them, then then I'll beat them off screen or something. If that's what you guys would like to see. If you guys don't want to see the same character over and over again. But if you guys like to see me fail over and over again, let me know. Oh, just not enough power. Every time I get screwed by less than a foot. Yeah, well, let's keep trucking here. We're doing pretty good still. Yeah, see this hole? If we're playing a high hand character, we can easily get over this. But we're not. So we have to rely on this. Which we didn't get, so hopefully. Okay. You don't have to hit extremely high to get over those. But, you know, with the wind not helping us, we're gonna end up in the water anyway, so it didn't matter that much. And of course, the game's still gonna tell us to aim that far, but. Whether it's gonna go that far or not, I don't know. I figured as much. <laughs> but thankfully it's mostly downhill, so that's pretty decent. And this hole also has to screw because it's a really big downhill slope and then it's into water. <laughs> so, honestly, sometimes you wanna hit below the flag because it will catch a nice hole on this hill. And it will go <laughs> very far. Okay, that should be easy enough. There we go. Alrighty, almost done. What's the tournament? And this is the hardest hole on the course because 20 yards down, the wind is normally not helping at all. The only way the wind can help, I would say, is if it's pushing off to pushing off to the right because there's a bit of fairway over there. And I've kind of learned over the years, just don't aim at the hole on this one. It's not going to happen. At least for me. Yeah, and just look at that. It's two feet down. And I barely hit that. At the, I hit that at the quarter mark, which should have gone about 15 feet. And it went about 45. That, hit, that hole is very difficult. I'm surprised that we got a part, to be honest. And this hole also likes to screw me, specifically. I've never seen anyone else struggle on this hole. I just really do. It doesn't like me. Why specifically? Because this hill right here, I always end up in this rough patch. And because of that, not, well, obviously I can't get out of it. Alright, hopefully that's enough to get it straight. At least, okay. I know it's going a little far to the left, but we did make it up there. I was expecting it to bounce backwards, and let me show you guys how bad that hill is. I didn't play enough curve. Wow, I'm really not paying attention today, which is quick because the voice of the is gonna kick our butt. Well, I know I say our butt because I'm the one taking it on. Either way, you know what I mean. Maybe entry, hopefully. Wind, ooh. I was about to say, the wind can screw you here as well because obviously we bought a habit. But it's not. Oh, but I screwed myself. <laughs> the sand trap. Yep. And of course, we're going to aim to try and get the distance on it, but I don't expect to get really anywhere. Besides, over here on the left. Okay, we're aiming for par. That's the goal here. We're aiming for par. Even though it's a par five. That's the first time we land on the freeway. <laughs> and no one's happy. Everyone's just like, oh, come on, dude. Finish the hole. Okay. Hopefully we can put that in for par at least. It's going up like a now watch. I'm going to lose it on the last hole. <laughs> Nope, we got lucky. We might still lose it though. Nope. Okay, even though, even despite him getting an eagle. Alright, that went horribly wrong. On the very last hole. <laughs> no, we still won. Alright. Yep, it's gonna take about four to five tournaments. Nothing good. And money. 
Hey. And we didn't unlock, we didn't even lock a uh, mirror mode for that course. Damn it, crap. Launch yourself, shotgun. Major. And now five versus about Time to finish off this. Well, I was gonna say finish off the screen, but I forgot about 1A. What difficulty? Your master. Shogun, I believe, is lower. Actually, you know, we just. We just played with Kamal. Let's go against Kamal. Why not? Okay, so back team. No, Mewood? Backpack Classic. This is her forced course. I say forced course because we can't change it. Alright, yeah, what's up, alright? What's up, Clink? I don't know if Master is lower than Shogun. I think it might be because I think we were a Master before we got the Shogun here. I can't remember. But we're gonna find out by seeing how difficult she is. So I'm sorry if you came to see Louise, but we're taking on Kamala. And her flight attendant suit, I believe it is. So far, so good. Oh. I thought it was my turn. Because <laughs> she went straight for it, so I expect her to be closer. Ah, she's going to play like Zeus, isn't she? Okay, I don't like that. <laughs> then again, I don't really like this course neither, so we'll find out what happens. When you were supposed to take it back further than that. Oh, not bad though. I could make that shot. Well then come do it for me. Alright. There we go. And she's obviously going to make that. Although I have seen people miss from here. Specifically me because I I sometimes if I'm really quick I can get I can get it to tap even slower or less power. And that screws me a lot because it goes, you know, not even two feet. I don't think I can do it anymore because I've kind of lost that ability and we hit a tree. Great. <laughs> okay, so she probably wins this hole. Unless she messes up as well. I don't think she will. Yeah, no, she's smart. <laughs> I was about to say, to aim for the green, we have to use a driver. Oh my gosh, yep, that's a fair. Alright, we lost this hole, guys. I'm not playing that well all of a sudden, you know? All she did hit it ridiculously hard, but she's still gonna beat us. Because, as long as she makes par, she beats us, because I have to chip the sand for par. And we didn't even give it enough power. <laughs> That's kind of a joke. Yeah. So, as long as she makes a par, she wins. And even then, she's going to make this because that's what they give us a UD pop. So there you go, we're losing. Okay, I guess Kamala's from Ohio. Alright. Still playing pretty decent, not really anything special so far, just I'm playing my crap. <laughs> if we're being honest, yeah, she's not really doing anything special, just I'm playing terrible. Okay. I think it's because I'm getting nervous for some reason. I'm psyching myself out here. Okay. I was kind of hoping to just go about the same spot she did, which is basically what we did. We went like a foot further. Oh, yeah. Alright, she's whacking full power there. Oh, I don't really fall on Playmore because that is a nasty hole where you can end up in the water very easily. So I'm honestly going to do the same thing pretty much. Except mine's going a bit further, so I'm hoping for like 98%. 100% oh, 
Oh, yeah, that's fine. I'll putt. I'm not going this yet. I'll putt. If she may. Oh, gosh. She might not make that one. Not quite. Okay. So if I make this, so I'm not going to chip. There we go. Alright, back to you. Yeah, these I noticed these videos are getting longer and longer because I'm taking my time more often in these late auctions. Hopefully that's still enough power to reach the green. Okay, I was expecting it to drop much shorter than that. Granted, I wanted the course on that. I'll take it though. I think I've got a beat because that's dropping way short to the point where I may be a sand trap. Ooh, wow. She got a monkey bones. <laughs> So that gives us a decent chance of winning, because one, she's bad in the sand. Two, she's in the sand. Alright, so we can win that. As long as I can make this putt, which is going to be difficult. I didn't hit her hard enough, are you kidding me? Oh, never mind. Okay. Okay, we're bringing it back now, we're bringing it back. All I heard was something about makeout. Which, just, no. <laughs> See, I'm kind of tempted to go through here. But I know my luck, so I'm not going to do it. So I'm going to do... Ah, uh, no, we can't make that. So, I'm going to reduce my club and go right about there. Okay, hopefully we can get over that tree as well. Okay. Because I know if I would have gone and tried to go through there, it would have ended up in a bad spot. I.e. out of bounds, most likely, like she's going to do. And yeah, that's out of bounds. Unless she finds a way to stay in bounds, but, you know, that's out of the map. <laughs> she fell off the map. I and she's still going to make part. Yeah, look at this. They know exactly how much code they can do. Yeah, she's still gonna make par, most likely. But we have a chance for booty. So I'm gonna... Not quite full power that. And I'm gonna slice it, because I can. Although, that can't help, because we missed the tree then. And I'm fine with that. She can't reach the green either, so she has to chip in for a part. Although, look at this. This is how well executed the AI is. Is that they know perfectly what they can and cannot do. Whereas me, I would never have tried that. Alright, now if I get close. That should be decent. We can make that. So, even if she chips us in, we got a pretty decent chance of winning. Which is a pretty good chance she'll chip in because she's on par right now. Yeah, uh, no, not quite. So, we can make par and win. Well, of course, I'm going to aim for better. Alright. And we'll make a bird with that as well. That's a little too easy to miss. <laughs> Getting a little cocky there, ain't I? Getting close to the end here. And something in my eye, of course. Alright, let's see. Ah, yes, this hole. So let's aim about there. I didn't want to hit full power, but I didn't want to try and risk going to my circle button to mix it up even more. So we'll take that. I was kind of hoping to go all the way down the hill, but that's funny. And this time she'll make it around the building. Because she has a pretty good curve. Not by a whole lot, but she may not. Alrighty. So this time we might hide, or she might beat us. 
depending on how close to the hole she gets. But from the way she's playing, she's gonna be right next to it. Watch this. Yeah, watch that. Four feet. Four point six. Okay, it would help if I hit full power and if I actually did stuff. Well, not full power, but a little more power than that. I think we got closer. Nope, 0.2 feet further away. But I'm gonna, you know, add a little extra power on that so it goes in. So we'll talk. Unless she misses, which I doubt. She might have. Are you kidding me? Are you kidding? You're on hard mode. This, what? Come on. Easy, does it? It's all a part of the plan. Just wait. Okay. I hope we can tie. <laughs> okay. Hopefully that's enough. I'm going to watch it out, but I'm very nervous this shot. Ooh, that's a great shot. Yeah, we can make that, as long as you don't make a hole in one. If she makes a hole in one, I will like if we can give her that point. Because compared to the last hole, that'd be a great improvement. Ooh, wow, she put him in on the queen. Alright, maybe we won't tie it all. Oh, crap. I got the hiccups. Perfect timing. <laughs> Mm, no, she made that. Hi. Well, we're not going to skunk her, but we will win. There we go. We up. And there we go. There's another versus round complete. Only about six more characters. Yeah, we're getting very close to the end. Not close enough that I can call it yet, but... I will call it once we complete every single hard mode versus in every single tournament. Stage trial. At least, because I know you guys probably don't want to see all the tournaments. If you want out of versus mode characters, we will go to stage trials. So we'll crack here, even though this is already 33 minutes long. We're going to check how many we have left. One, two, three, four, five, six. That's it. We only have yep six more. So we have Louise, who is a shogun. Rene, who is mighty. T Rod, who is a king. Chaos, which is master. Maya, who is also a shogun, and we have Z, who is all mighty. All right. So next time we're probably gonna take on Chaos. Because I forgot about the Master Link. So Chaos and then Louise. Maybe we'll see. Hope you guys enjoyed the video and I hope you have a good day. And we'll see you all later.